Hello, all creative content creators. In this video, I am going to show you how to use the Motion Tween plugin in Premiere Pro. If you have no knowledge of keyframes or animation on Premiere Pro, so the Motion Tween is the best option for you. Motion Tween is a film impact plugin. With this plugin, you can make easily different types of animations. Just drag and drop solution in Premiere Pro. So, let's get started. Now we are inside Premiere Pro. Here, you can see, I have already got video footage. In this tutorial, I am going to use the Motion Tween plugin of Film Impact Company. Film Impact Premium Video Editing Tools are guaranteed to help video editors to save time on video edits. Film Impact always offers 30 days free unrestricted access. That's why, you can easily use 30 days Film Impact Video Editing Tool for free. First of all, move over to the Effects panel. Here, you can see the list of Film Impact plugins. You can see, Film Impact Animations, Distortions, Film Impact Essentials, Lights and Blurs, Film Impact Smart Tools, and Transformers. In this video, I am going to use the Motion Tween effect, from this Smart Tools section. Now, I am going to show you, how we can smoothly zoom in, and zoom out, by using this Motion Tween effect. Firstly, we have to cut the video, where we want to use, zoom in, and zoom out effect. So, as you can see here, a total of three clips, have been created. So, we have to apply the motion tween effect, at this first cut point. And, at this second cut point. Now, we need to zoom in, on this middle clip, a little bit. That's why, move over to the effect controls panel. Then, we have to increase the scale value, to zoom the video. Next, resize and reposition the video. Now, you can see, our first clip is normal, the second clip is zoomed in, and the third clip is normal. Now, move over to the effects panel, to add the motion tween effect. Now, drag and drop this motion tween effect, to this first cut point. Next, select this motion tween effect, and move over to the effect controls panel. Here, you can see the interface, of the motion tween plugin. From here, we have to select Bezier. By the way, you can select any of them. For my case, I am going to select Bezier. Now, let's preview the video. Here, you can see a black border. So, this is not perfect. To remove this black border, select this motion tween effect, and move over to the effect controls panel. Now, from the presets panel, we have to select, recover out of screen image data. Now, you can see, the black border has vanished. So, let's preview, how this works. This is perfect for us. Now, we will use the zoom out effect, to move from this middle clip to the last clip. That's why, move over to the effects panel, to add the motion tween effect. Now, drag and drop this motion tween effect, to this second cut point. Next, select this motion tween effect, and move over to the effect controls panel. Here, you can see the interface of the motion tween plugin. Now, from the presets section, we have to select, recover out of screen image data. Then, make sure the visual curve type is Bezier. Now, we are done. So, let's preview, how this works. In this way, you can use, zoom in, and zoom out effects, in any kind of video. Now, I am going to show you, how to use, the zoom in bounce effect, and the zoom out bounce effect, in any kind of video. Now, we need to zoom in, a little bit on this middle clip. That's why, select this middle clip, and move over to the effect controls panel. Then, we have to increase the scale value, of the video, to zoom in. Next, resize and reposition the video. Now, move over to the effects panel, to add the motion tween effect. Now, drag and drop this motion tween effect, to this first cut point. Next, select this motion tween effect, and move over to the effect controls panel. Here, you can see the interface of the motion tween plugin. From here, we have to select bounce. Now, from the presets panel, we have to select, recover out of screen image data. Now, let's preview the video. Now, 
Now, you can see, the zoom and bounce effect is perfectly applied. Now, we will use the zoom out bounce effect, to move from this middle clip to the last clip. That's why, move over to the effects panel, to add the motion tween effect. Now, drag and drop this motion tween effect, to this second cut point. Next, select this motion tween effect, and move over to the effect controls panel. Here, you can see the interface of the motion tween plugin. Now, from the presets section, we have to select, recover out of screen image data. Then, make sure the visual curve type is bounce. Now, we are done. So, let's preview, how this works. You can see, this is perfect. In this way, you can use, zoom in, the zoom in bounce effect, and the zoom out bounce effect. Now, I am going to show you, how to animate a text, by using the motion tween plugin. Here, you can see, I have already got a text, and background. Now, I am going to cut the text layer, at this point. So, as you can see here, a total of two parts, have been created. Now, select the first part, and move over to the effect controls panel. Now, from the motion control panel, move the text, outside the top of the frame. Next, move over to the effects panel, to add the motion tween effect. Now, drag and drop this motion tween effect, to this cut point. Next, select this motion tween effect, and move over to the effect controls panel. Here, you can see the interface of the motion tween plugin. From here, we have to select bounce. Let's see the preview. This is perfect. Also, you can select Overshoot, and Bejeer. And, from the Presets panel, you can select any of the presets, that you like. Try one by one, and make sure, which is perfect for you. In this way, you can animate your text, by using the Motion Tween plugin. In the same way, also, you can animate your logo like this. Let's see, how you get 4 premium transitions, for free. And, how to start your 30 days free plan. First of all, go to the Film Impact website. And then, click on Get Free Access. After that, you will see this page. Here, you have to give your full name. Next, you have to give your valid mail address. After that, from here, select all the premium video transitions. And finally, click on this Get Me Started button. And, check your email, to get your download link. They have sent your download link, by email. After downloading the software, install this on your computer. Next, open Premiere Pro. And, start with your project. After that, move over to the effects panel. And here, you can see, all the video editing tools, of Film Impact. Next, drag and drop any of the effects, to your project in the timeline. Then, select the effect, and move over to the effect controls panel. Here, you can see the interface of Film Impact. Next, click on this Get 30 Days Free Access button. Now, click on Get Free Access Now. After that, you have to give your first name, and last name. Also, you have to give your mail address, which is given already on their website. And then, click on this Get Your Personal Access Code button. Then here, you have to give your personal 6-digit code. And finally, click on the Let's Go button. Now, we are done. In this way, you can download and use, Film Impact in Premiere Pro. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, like the video and leave a comment.